Hello everyone and welcome to our physical science class. Ang lesson natin ngayon ay tungkol sa the formation of elements during the Big Bang and during stellar evolution. At the end of this video, you will be able to explain where these elements came from and how they were formed. Science Escuela! <laughs> Nagsimula ang lahat a few seconds or a few moments after the Big Bang. Nagcombine ang mga quarks to form protons and neutrons. And a few moments later, nagcombine naman ang mga protons and neutrons to form helium, lithium, and beryllium through the process of Big Bang nucleosynthesis. Pero ano nga ba ang Big Bang nucleosynthesis? You will be able to understand this better kung alam mo or maunawaan mo itong four important concepts. Concept number one. The Big Bang is an expansion of space. 14 billion years ago, nagsimulang mag-expand the universe at hanggang sa ngayon ay nag expand siya. Concept number two. As the universe expands, it cools. Habang nag expand the universe, lalo itong lumalamig. Concept number three. The more energetic the particles are, the higher the temperature will be. So sa palagay mo, alin ang mas energetic? Ang mga particles ng yellow o particles ng tubig? That is right. Ang particles ng tubig ay mas energetic because it is hotter. Concept number four. The identity of an element depends on how many protons it has. Kung ang element ay may isang proton, ibig sabihin siya ay hydrogen. Kung may dalawang protons, helium. It doesn't matter how many neutrons they have. Just count the number of protons and you will be able to know what type of element it is. Now that you know these four important concepts, we can now talk about the Big Bang nucleosynthesis. Sobrang init ng universe a few seconds after the Big Bang. At dahil doon, ang mga protons at neutrons natin ay sobrang energetic din na kapag sila ay nagbabanggaan, nasisira lang sila at hindi sila nagkocombine. Pero hindi naman habang buhay na mainit ang universe. Remember concept number two? Habang nag expand ang universe, lalo itong lumalabig. That is why, a few minutes after the Big Bang, the temperature of the universe dropped to a point where the protons and neutrons could combine when they collided. And that's where the Big Bang nucleosynthesis started. So basically, a nucleosynthesis starts when a proton and a neutron combines to form Deuteron. Ang deuteron ay isang isotope ng hydrogen. So, we will talk about isotopes in our later chapters. Pero paano ba natin nalaman na ang deuteron na ito ay isang isotope ng hydrogen at hindi ng kung anumang element? That is right. Ang deuteron ay may isang proton. Kaya alam natin na ito ay isang hydrogen. Remember, concept number four. The identity of an element depends on how many protons it has. Now, let's continue. When deuteron hits another neutron and combines with it, it forms triton. And triton has one proton, ibig sabihin, isa siyang isotope ng hydrogen. Soon, another proton will hit triton and combine with it. Now, our nucleon has two protons and two neutrons. Question. This is a nucle nucleus of which element? That's right. Since it has two protons, this is an example of, or this is a nucleus of helium. At sa ganoong paraan, nabubuo ang, nabuo ang helium through the process of nucleosynthesis. Pero, paano naman nabuo ang lithium at beryllium? It requires more energy to form them kasi mas mabigat sila o mas malaki sila kumpara sa hydrogen at helium. Kaya nga mas konting lithium at beryllium lang yung nabuo. One way lithium was formed was through the collision and combination of helium-4 and triton. And one way beryllium was formed was through the collision and combination of helium-4 and helium-3. And that is how the light elements were formed through the process of nucleosynthesis. Now, 20 minutes after the Big Bang, the temperature of the universe continued to drop until the protons and neutrons were no longer able to combine. Kulang na sila sa energy. Remember concept number three? Mas malamig, mas konti ang energy. 
kapag nag-co-collide sila, nagbabounce lang sila. So today, we'll learn how the light elements hydrogen, helium, lithium, and beryllium were formed. Sa susunod na episode o sa susunod na lesson, matututunan naman natin kung paano nabuo ang mga heavier elements. So see ya! Ini yung may bigo. I know your eyes in the morning sun I feel you touch me in the pouring rain And the moment that you wonder far from me <laughs> and you come to me on a summer breeze. <laughs>